Hello, my name is Master Chu. Welcome to the Sword and Blade Part 4. So today you're going to need two styrofoam cups, and you're also going to need stone spray paint. Because stone is the old look we need. So, you have to cut it halfway down in a styrofoam cup. You stick it up here, and we're going to use duct tape for that. This piece is the second handle, which is going to be here, and we're going to use duct tape for that. But you're going to cut it real small. They're about... You're going to leave three-fourths. So, I'll do that. I'll duct tape them on, and then we're going to go outside, and we're going to spray paint it with stone. So, I'll be right back. And using the top from this one, you got to trim it. We're going to stick that on the bottom, too. And we're going to roll up some duct tape and put in there, and put in that. See? We're going to do that first. We're going to do that one first. We're going to do this one, and we're going to do that one. Okay. So now that we have the handles for two hands, and we have the big mace up here, we're going to go in the back, 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 like way out in the field over there. Or not the field, the parking lot. <laughs> He's saying field because I went on a little into the wood thing with my brother looking for morales last week. So what we're doing is we're going to go out there with the stone spray paint, and we're going to spray paint this sucker till it is dripping wet with gray stone. So I'll be right back. Once again, wearing a face mask. Dang it, it's falling off. Because this does have da dangerous chemicals in it, the stone. It has a lot of stuff that if you breathe in, it can create some lasting damage if you breathe in a lot. So I'm going to use some of this. And we're going to be going outside in the back. So I'm going to put my phone in my pocket for now. And then we're going to spray paint it. 